council, you know, a council meeting and there's, you know, thousands of people here, that's, they needed a good source of water. And that's mm -hmm. why this is the perfect spot. Um, and as you can see, there are gate, locked gates, a fence all the way around, and there are signs that say no trespassing. Um, we, we do that for obvious safety reasons, but the main reason is, is that this water is still very sacred to the Cherokee people. Um, in fact, they still use it today for ceremonial purposes, and they are the only ones that we allow in there for that reason. Uh, sometimes we'll block off the exits, we'll keep everyone back and allow them to have their, their private time. Um, just like you wouldn't go to church and swim in a, bas a baptismal at the church, it would be the exact same thing. And that's why I try to explain to people, and they're like, oh, and then they, it makes them get it, you know. Yeah. Um, and also, the Cherokee believe that this water is medicine. Uh, and, you know, actually, they're, they're right. Because, you know, when you have a hurt foot or a hurt knee or something, what do you put on it? You put ice. So this water is very cold. So it's going to help with the, the inflammatory process for sure. Um, so any questions about that? 